This One News update is brought to you by ANZ, proud sponsor of the New Zealand Olympic team. Animal welfare activists blockaded a poultry farm near Dunedin this morning in protest over the use of cages for layer hens. They're blocking access to one of the largest battery cage facilities in the country, mainland poultry at Waikawaiti. One News reporter Megan Martin joins us now by phone. Megan. Good afternoon. Yes, the, at about 3.30 this morning, the pro protesters set up their tripods. Uh, two protesters are sitting at the apex of those uh, that scaffolding, and one woman has uh, chained herself to the fence. Initially, they were turning the workers away and, and the workers were turning back, but it turns out they have uh, managed to find an alternative route through paddock roads. Uh, the trucks aren't getting through, though. That's some of those big, heavy traffic. Um, that includes feed trucks for the hens, so there could be a problem if they don't get through too soon, uh, ironically, with the welfare of the hens. The protesters, however, are determined to get their point across. Uh, battery cages are cruel, illegal, they have to go. But we are also telling them the proposed colony cages are not acceptable. They are also cruel, they are also illegal, they are not an acceptable replacement for battery cages. Police have been at the scene all morning and just within the last five minutes I've heard that um, a cherry picker is on its way. So one would guess that some of those uh, protesters are going to be um, pulled down shortly. There are strong winds forecast for this afternoon, so there is some concern about their safety. Thank you. That's Megan Martin reporting from that poultry farm blockade. And we'll have the latest on this on the 4.30 and 6 o'clock news later in the day. This One News update is brought to you by ANZ, proud sponsor of the New Zealand Olympic team.